And so the genesis of this project was uh, Dr. Zubala and I were on the Mentoring and Development Committee, um, which is serving that role for the trainees, mentoring and, and helping them develop, and also assessing them. And at the first meeting of that committee, uh, my graduate student, Mo Dan, Dr. Zubala were out in the hall cooling their heels, waiting for us to get to them, and started talking. And that was the genesis where Mo presented we have this desire and we have these techniques, but what we need is to partner with someone who can create the materials that uh, we want to study that would hopefully uh, deliver drugs to this specific target site. You know, as, as much as I would love to think that, you know, I, I had any uh, real say or, or direction, it was really kind of just my rubber stamping saying, that's, you guys are great. This is, you know, great, great ideas. It was uh, Dave and Mo coming up, helping up with the experimental plans, what they're going to do, what the next steps should be, and just running with it. So, and that all came from uh, just a simple interaction one afternoon. And that's, uh, uh, I think, uh, great science kind of happens that way. So, so I think this university has a very good environment to encourage collaboration. Um, I've been here a long time. I think that's been one of the benefits. I've collaborated with a lot of people. I, I view this as a full service university. We have essentially every discipline from my perspective as a biomedical researcher on, on one campus within walking distance. And that gives us a great advantage over some other institutions. Uh, when I got here, actually, when I was first uh, uh, interviewed, uh, the thing that attracted me to UK the most was the fact that you know it, it has a college of medicine, it has a college of pharmacy, which is you know unique. Not most schools have one. It has a college of engineering, all within a 15-minute walking from each other. And buildings are quite close. The sense of collaboration was was apparent. I, I hadn't met anyone that wouldn't be willing to uh, work together, that wouldn't be willing to uh, provide access to equipment that they had. Or, or just make things happen. So I've been here almost 35 years because there has been no good reason for me to go elsewhere. I came here, this university enabled me to do what I've been able to do to pursue what I want to pursue, and there's been no reason for me to, to consider going elsewhere because I don't feel I could have achieved anything more at any other place than this university. The work I'm doing at UK would be completely different than the work I'd be doing anywhere else just because I really enjoy working and, and kind of tapping into what is around me, what the surroundings are, and taking best advantage of that. I can think of multiple examples of, of, of when that's happened, where this kind of um, serendipitous uh, uh, idea came about just because it's um, uh, two people had very similar work or very complementary work that they could just do something together and be very easy to do. The goal is to set up an environment that, that fertilizes people to talk, to interact, and um, Often good things come out of that that you wouldn't predict.